In this video, I will demonstrate how to capture kinetic data using a spectrometer while running a reaction using sodium hydroxide and a solution of the drugs phenylax or pyoctanin. To begin, first plug in the spectrometer to your computer and launch the Logger Pro software. You should see a rainbow background if it is connected properly. If you see a no device connected error, try unplugging the spectrometer, relaunching Logger Pro, and plugging the spectrometer back in. Before you begin, you need to calibrate the spectrometer. From the Experiments menu at the top of the screen, select Calibrate, Spectrometer 1, and then wait 90 seconds for the lamp to warm up. While you wait, fill a clean cuvette about two-thirds full with nanopure water to use as a blank. After the 90 seconds is up, place the blank cuvette in the spectrometer, select Finish Calibration, and then OK. To set up the spectrometer to capture absorbance data over time, begin by selecting the rainbow graph icon in the top middle of the screen. This will open up the Configure Spectrometer window. On the left, change the collection mode to absorbance versus time, and then select your desired wavelength. For this demonstration, I will set the wavelength to 550 nanometers, but this will differ depending on the type of drug solution you use. Consult your project guide for more specific information. To change the duration of time the spectrometer will be collecting data, click on the Experiment tab at the top of the screen to bring up a drop-down menu. Select Data Collection from this menu and click on the Duration box. The units should be set to seconds, and 200 will be the default. Go ahead and change the duration to 300 seconds. The mode should also be time-based, and the box Sample at Time 0 should be selected. Click Done or OK when finished. Now you can begin preparing your sample. First, you will need to transfer 1 milliliter of your drug solution into a clean 1 dram vial, and about 10 milliliters of sodium hydroxide to a 20 milliliter plastic vial. You should set up your micropipettes with your desired volumes before you begin to make running the reaction quicker. To begin your reaction, transfer 3 milliliters of sodium hydroxide to a clean 1 dram vial. Then transfer the desired drug solution to the same vial, cap it, and shake it. Next, use a transfer pipette to fill a clean cuvette about two-thirds full with the reaction mixture. You need to move quickly, as the reaction is very time-sensitive. Wipe off the exterior of the cuvette with a Kim wipe, and then place it into the spectrometer with the arrow facing forward. In Logger Pro, press the green Collect button and let the reaction run for the designated amount of time. When the time is up, the data collection will automatically stop. The absorbance values of your reaction mixture should be less than 1. If it is greater than 1, please dilute your drug solution more and try the reaction again. Save your data to Excel when finished. If you notice the absorbance values start skipping or lagging, you can fix this by clicking the rainbow absorbance icon at the top left of the screen. This will open the Spectrometer 1 dialog box, and here you should change the samples to average from 10 to 1. Close this page when you are finished. When you are done, make sure to dispose of any solutions into the liquid waste bucket, clean any plastic or glassware with deionized water, and leave them to dry in your locker on a paper towel. Hopefully this video was helpful in showing you how to set up and run a kinetics reaction. Good luck and enjoy your time in lab!